Well, I'm outside Hayes Pavilion where the Montana State hockey team has been putting in the work all season long and it's paid off. They're headed to Boston in a couple of weeks for nationals and this season has been nothing short of incredible. The Bobcats won back to back MWCHL championships and finished second in the West region and third in the nation. They received a bye past regionals for the first time in program history and they're headed straight to the ACHA national championships. This whole season we've been uh, focused on just straight going to nationals and getting that by and I think that's a big difference. Last year we were focused on just making it to nationals versus now being a contender at nationals. And have they been able to accomplish this feat? I think everyone just knows their role on the team right now and we're all you know doing our jobs and doing what we're supposed to. Guys aren't trying to do too much and it's you know it's working for us for sure. And each member of the team is committed. The rigor has increased as nationals gets closer. We're adding extra practices, adding workouts, uh, a lot of stuff on the rink as well as away from the rink, kind of getting our bodies ready. But for the Bobcats, they are more than just a team with a goal. They're a family that has been working day in and day out to better themselves and the team. Um, the past couple of years, I guess just being able to get on the ice and, you know, being part of a group where, you know, you can call them more than just your friends or the camaraderie. The Cats are on the cusp of making history. The moment of winning it all is what players work for their entire lives. It'd definitely be one of the biggest payoffs, like, some of guys' hockey careers, you know. Being able to, being able to hoist a cup at Nationals is, is definitely pretty much every hockey player's dream at some point. Oh, it would be, a, there's no words to describe what that would be like. But you could say they always knew what they were capable of. Dave, uh, the head coach, uh, said five years ago that this would be the year that we win it. And so it'd be really cool to five years later to be the actual team to win it. So that's pretty awesome. To help the team get to nationals, associate head coach Pete Cammon has created a GoFundMe for all donations. In Bozeman, Grace Lawrence, MTN Sports.